Hey guys, welcome to LZH Project. My name is Salman Francis and this is the 13th video of our LZH series. And this is continuation of our previous videos uh, with Linux file permission. And this in today's video we will discuss sticky bit. So what is a sticky bit? A sticky bit is a set of permission which is used to avoid deletion of files and folders by other users if they have permission to do so. For example, uh, only root and owner of the folder can delete the file or the directory, but others cannot. So let's see by one example. So let me create a, a folder, uh, make, sorry, KDIR sticky. Okay, and we can see that we have this sticky folder uh, let me create a file and move that file into this uh, sticky folder so we will create a file and put some content in it hello world file1.txt and and move this file1.txt to sticky okay so if we go to sticky now we can see we have a file and by checking the content of this file we can see it's hello world is there okay so what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to switch myself as user root And I am going to set the permission on this folder, chmod plus t. Plus t is how you set the sticky bit. And if we check the permission on this folder, we will see that there is, uh, the permission starts with four, and then uh, it carries on. So this four means it's uh, a sticky bit is set on it. So, uh, to check this, uh, let me ls-l, and here we can see that the sticky is now highlighted. Okay, so let's uh, go back in this folder and create some file, bc.txt. Okay, now let's give these files all the permission so that everyone can delete it or do whatever they want so ch mode plus um, let's say 777 or abc and file ls-l and we can see that we have full permission like for others, for group members, and anyone can delete these files. So let's see if somebody tries to delete these files. Uh, we should remember that we have applied sticky permissions to the folder. And let's see. So let me switch back to user B first. And basically user B is the owner of file 1, but he's not the owner of ABC file. So let's try to remove this file he was able to do it because he was the owner but let me switch back to a user a okay and now let's he cannot even enter into this sticky bit because he don't have set of permission for that uh, let me check the file permission, uh, folder permission. Okay, so it's basically, you can see that there's a capital T. It means that he don't have any permission to enter this directory. Let's, uh, let's change uh, the permission for this directory also. So at least he can enter into this. Switch to user root. and ch mod 777 for sticky 
okay now switch back to user a and now if we check directory uh, and it's uh, like that capital T is gone now and let's go in this now he should be able to yet yeah, he's in this directory who am I I'm user a okay let's try to delete this file now and he is able to delete the file I think the sticky bit is not set properly it's not set properly because we uh, forgot to mention where we need to apply the sticky bit so let me switch back to user root and okay let me create two files here again touch file one.txt file two.txt okay and sticky bit should be chmod plus uh, o plus t this means on others put sticky bit so ls dash l now we can see that there is a t at the end now it should work so let's try to give full permissions again to these files chmod 777 file 1 and file 2 so, okay now let me switch back to user a okay who am i who am i user a now try to delete the file not work here we go so this time the he cannot delete the file because uh, before we were not able to put sticky bit properly we needed to mention where we need to put sticky bits for and now uh, try to remove the other file operation not permitted so this is how we can use sticky bit to avoid accidental deletions uh, let's change the user user b oh sorry switch user b and now try to remove the file and he is able to remove the file because he is the owner of this directory he created this directory if we go back uh, to uh, outside and let's list the content and we can see that he the user B is the owner just after two you can see his name so that's why he was able to delete so only user who created the directory and the root are permitted to delete the content uh, let's uh, log in with user C and check if we can delete. We should not be able to actually. But anyway, just for checking. Sticky. Okay, operation not permitted. So that's how it proved uh, how sticky bits work. And I hope you guys also understood. And thank you very much for watching and please don't forget to subscribe on our YouTube YouTube channel and hope to see you in next video until then goodbye